What's good, everybody? It's your boy, Bull City Media, back at it again with another video, man. I've been gone for a little minute, took a brief hiatus, been having a lot of things, personal things that I've had to get situated, but I'm back in full effect. So, by the title of this video, you've seen, Do Black Men Hate Black Women? Um, I want to delve down onto this topic is because I've seen in the last few weeks, last few months, last year or so, I've just been seeing so many black women saying black men um they don't like black women and we don't res black men don't respect black women and i can't say anything but that is the farthest from the truth so my issue with that topic is or those statements is that um anytime you lump a whole mass of people by your accounts with a few it's not right that's that's like the equivalency of me saying i can't that's the equivalency of a female saying niggas ain't shit or it ain't no good niggas out here how would you know you haven't dated you haven't messed with you haven't talked you don't even know all the dudes so for you to say that is in fact demeaning and it's very very disrespectful to black men the, the good black men out there because there are a lot of good black men and and in fact i would like to argue that there are more good black men out there than ain't shit niggas so my thing with that is it's just it's just the meaning and i hear a lot of females say their argument is oh trust me in the same token that i can say that it's hard being a black man out here, one of the hardest jobs in the world. I can say that for black women as well. Definitely can say that. I will say this, black women are the most disrespected creatures on earth and black men are the most demonized creatures on earth. So it goes hand in hand. And I just feel like the time that we have, that we spend fighting with each other, going back and forth, we could be using that to build each other up. Um, we not gonna get nowhere just shitting on each other and i think i would like to agree i would like for everybody to agree that we just doing the rest of the world's job when we just tearing each other down um you don't see chinese tearing down their men and women you don't see the whites tearing down their men and women and you definitely don't see the hispanics tearing down their women and men so it's just like where do we come to get to a happy median that or a common ground that we can respect each other. Um, and I think it starts with each other. It starts with myself. Me, I'm a lover of all. Like, I, white women, Chinese, black, but I love me some beautiful brown women. Love, 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 love. You know what I'm saying? And it's just a spit in my face when I hear that. And it's, it, it's not right. And I feel like with this new era of the and let me preface this by saying it's nothing against anybody that's homosexual gay lgbtq all of that um if you look at one of my previous videos i've done i did an interview with a transgender um who's a good friend of mine um but i would like to say this i think that i think that we are more we're i just wish uh, not all but i wish some of these black women would fight as hard for as they do for LGBTQ community as they would for that black for that black men. Um, we need it. Um, and this video is about black men. Um, I do another one on the respect issues pertaining to women, but I'm not talking about the disrespect to black women. To this video, um, even though it is, it's it's right in our face. It's imminent. It's all of the above. But right now, this video is about the disrespect to the black man. At the end of the day, the man is the head of the household and we need to garner that respect. And obviously, we have to start respecting ourselves as kings so that everybody else may follow, but it has to start somewhere. It has to, like women, ladies, queens. We can't continue to, it's no good black man out there um niggas ain't shit because at the end of the day what are you that y'all perpetuating that cycle down into your kids um down into your to your daughters and they're gonna grow up thinking the same thing and it's like you be the change that you would like to see in somebody um it's plenty of good dudes out there you and let's let's do this let's take a self-reflection 
Let's look in the mirror, ladies. If you keep finding dudes that ain't shit, what's the common what's the common part in all of that? It's you yourself. If you keep finding these dudes that like what are you attracted that, that you can't attract a good dude? Vice versa with a man. If I'm always finding attracting broken women and women with attitude, anger issues, what does that say about me? It might say that I'm broken. I have internal issues that I need to fix with myself. So, um, I would definitely, like I said, y'all comment, like, subscribe, all that. Um, but definitely comment, and I want to hear your thoughts on on this topic because this is a deep, 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 deep topic. Self hate is at an all time high now, and you would think that it's coming from men, but nowadays. It's coming from the ladies, man. And that and that pains me to say because me and my friends, all of my, my dudes that I know, my black friends, we you won't catch us disrespecting black women as a whole. You will never hear us say, oh, I'm not dating black women or I ain't messing with no black females because they're this, this, and that. That is straight coon shit. Never. You, you might hear, I'm not messing with that girl. I'm not messing with Sharika or... Tiana, that one instance, because we know her personally. But when y'all women say, ain't this, this, that, black man, this, this and that, you tell, you telling on yourself, sweetie. You telling on yourself. And at the end of the day, what what is the issue statistically proven more black men marry black women than they do out of any other race? So that notion that Oh, black black men only want black women. It's the farthest from the truth, and that's bullshit. And I'm sick of hearing that. It's not true at all. And what at the end of the day, love is love. So no matter if you a black man and you want to marry a white woman, purple, yellow, vice versa for ladies. Like if you want you a white man, and if you're doing it in love, you will never hear me say coon, sell out, any of that. Because at the end of the day, if you're marrying somebody or you decide to be with somebody out of love, then what can I say? But when you're sitting here, I'm going to find me a white, I'm going to get me a Jacob or a Timothy because Tyrone's doing me bad. That's the You're doing the same shit that you get mad at these black athletes or other dudes that, because they this, they said that, and and, and and let's get on that too. The men that are doing that, shameful. You come from a black woman, you're raised by a black woman, and you disrespect black women, because of a few instances with previous females that maybe even you you caused, you know what I'm saying? So, man, we just got to do better as a people. Like, I can't stress it enough. Like, I, I was on Facebook today, and I had raised a discussion, and I got good feedback. Um, I, I love to, I don't want everybody to always agree with what I say. I want you to, I want you to hear what I say, and then I want you to listen, and then you give me your side of it and then maybe we can meet in the middle somewhere you know what i'm saying because it takes more of that and i think a lot of people men and women aren't really willing to listen to what the other side has to say they just want to speak and a lot of times they're speaking from a place of hurt and it's not coming from a place of actual understanding and knowledge and i think that both sides lack on that so Man, just um, y'all comment, like, subscribe. Let me know more topics that you would like me to discuss. And at the end of the day, stop the self hate. You know what I'm saying? Like we need the we we should be sticking together the most at these times. These are trying times, and we won't get nowhere with the self hate. So appreciate the love as always, the love and the support. It's your boy Boy City Media. Y'all take it easy.